All right, guys, welcome to chapter 10 of A Plague Tale Innocence. This is the Way of Roses. For some reason, I don't think this is going to be all roses in this chapter. The university. Right, the book. Remember Lucas said in the basement, the path is strewn with roses. Roses. Wherever will I find roses here? Okay, so it said follow the banners with the roses. Why couldn't he have been more specific when he said that? <laughs> It didn't have to be, a, like, a big riddle. He could have just been, you know, literal about it. It was just us that he was talking to. Anyways, guys, we're, like, deep in enemy territory here, and I'm pretty scared, so... Yeah, I'm on my rocks. I'm ready to rock anybody in the face who comes at me. There are a lot of dudes outside. Maybe there won't be quite so many in here. It's locked. That's fine. Honestly, in a place like this, I would kind of rather be funneled in the uh, the right direction. Not really noticing any roses just yet. Hmm. Well, this looks like a place that would have a book. Oh, it's enormous. But where have the books gone? I mean, there's some left. We'll double back there in a moment. Oh, hello. See? Just gotta look around a little bit, guys. Right. It's kind of weird that they would, they would put so many doors in here, and then you can't actually open any of them. Like, I understand one or two, just to kind of give you the idea that you're being funneled, but, like, four? That seems excessive. There, the banners. Flowers. Yes, there are roses. I'm on the right track. Oh, good. Let's go this way, then. <laughs> Anybody up here? I'm ready for you bastards. That would be the door that doesn't open. This probably leads out back to the front, right? And yeah, we can't even try. Okay. This strikes me as one of those areas that's just going to have a lot of landmass to explore. Little nooks and crannies, side paths. So far, not a whole lot going on in terms of actual collectibles, though. So. How many days have we been here? I've lost count. Can't even tell the difference between day and night anymore. Shut up in here. It'll soon be over. Vitalis has brought back a young lad to open the last door. Days we've been here. And the Grand Inquisitor himself is coming to help us. That'll be quite an event. Right. Is it just you? You should probably just take this guy out, right? I wonder if the rats can get no in rats. here. It's strange. <laughs> Speak of the devil. <laughs> okay. Let's take a look at our inventory here, guys. We're doing pretty okay. We've got many things. I'll tell you what, let's make a couple more odorous. And one more Deverantis. Because that uses alcohol. And I was full on alcohol. Also, I might need it to take out this guy. I can't tell if he has a helmet on from back here. I don't think he does. Hmm. Question I have is, is it going to be noisy if I take him out? Like, if I can't kill him right away with a rock, is he going to yell and scream and bring other people in here? You would think not. That's not really how the game has worked up to this point. Can I knock that chandelier down on him? That would be noisy. But also kind of amazing. But I don't think I can do that. Okay. Go to sleep, buddy. <laughs> Amicia was worried about that, too. She's like, ooh, that was noisy. That was definitely noisy. 
Yeah, I guess I just wasn't supposed to suffer this guy to live. Oh, his eyes are still open. Oh, that makes me feel a little bad. But, not really. Because, screw the enemies in this game. You know, it's not like they're, uh... <laughs> they're, like... These survivors just trying to do what they can to get by. They're, like, actively mean a lot of the time. They're just rude. It's like they take joy in subjugating people. I guess hard times breed hard men, right? But I don't see that as, like, a valid excuse to be taking joy in the suffering of others. Alright, so we do have this block over here. We can probably use that to climb up somewhere. Just wanted to make sure I pick up everything. I think we're good here. I think we got all the stuff we need. Definitely have roses over here. So that's where we're headed. I wonder if it'll just let me climb up pretty much anywhere. This seems like it's maybe not going to work. Right here. Yeah. Um, where does it want me to bring it? Maybe back this way. Just try to get this thing lined up here so I can just push it straight back. Looks like that railing snapped off right there, so like maybe I can scramble up from that side. There we go. That's pretty. Okay, we're gonna go in right there. Let me just pop over yonder. Hello. Sulfur. Full up on sulfur. Let's see. Let's see if I can make some room for that. Uh, yeah. Ignifer. Nope. I'm full up on Ignifer. What? Okay. Uh, we'll make some more odorous then. That's good for now. One can never have enough books, if one can read. Bah, it's all just pagan stuff. The Sanguinus Itinera is a sacred book. The knowledge it contains goes back to the dawn of man, and this knowledge could save us all. So keep searching, and concentrate on looking for books with a red, with the a book, red cover. The Sanguinus yeah, Itinera. I might not They're be able to read, too. but that doesn't mean I'm I'd stupid. better be quick. Hmm, I wonder why they're looking for the same book. They must know more about Hugo than I thought. That is not good. I'm gonna have to fight them for it, guys. Luckily, I got plenty of rocks. And Amicia doesn't really seem to have too many reservations about killing people anymore. <laughs> it's just like, fuck these guys. I'm gonna take them all out. Okay, okay, um... Maybe I can sneak up on this dude and chloroform him. What did that take? Somnum, yes. Although, frankly, that costs way more to make than a Devorantis does, so maybe I'd be better off using this and just rocking him. I guess Somnum is more for, like, a get-out-of-jail-free card if you get caught or you have no other option, you know? I wonder what happens if I Devorantis this guy first. Does the alchemist freak out and come at me? We have to experiment a little bit, guys. We gotta see how this goes. Nice. 
That works. That works for me. As long as it doesn't piss off anybody else. Thank you for the leather. It's really rare to find leather. That's one of the most restricted resources, it seems. And we need to make room for more sulfur. Okay. We're now full on that. Fuck it. We're full on everything. Oh, and I guess that was the 100th thing I've crafted because I just got an achievement for it. <laughs> cool. Alright. And let's see. I just... I'm assuming I can't actually make anything new right now. Yeah. Okay. Oh, hello. Yeah, guys, it seems like we're not even really trying to go for stealth anymore. I guess, like, anybody I find in this area, I'm just taking them out. I feel like it would have been exceedingly difficult to stay stealthy and get around these guys here, so... At least those fucking rats won't there are the roses. Go. I'm on the right track. Cool. So what do we got? We got... I'm telling you, next time he talks to me like that, I'll stuff one of his bloody books in his cup. <laughs> With a red cover, it's favorite scent. <laughs> the book. Another brilliant idea from the alchemist. There's something shady about those guys. Too true. There's parts of the Bastion I don't go anymore. The things they're doing there. Yeah, let's not talk about it. Okay, so if these guys are going to stay facing that way, then I guess I'm good here. Shit. Ah, there they are. Yep. Well, we do have rats have here. To get rid of the gods so I can get past. Okay, well, I guess we're not good then. I guess we are going to take these jerks out. <laughs> okay, let's, uh... Let's start from right here. Over there. Oh, what? Ah! Ah! Oh, that sucked. I don't know how that missed. I really don't. Luckily, I had my backup plan. All right. Everything's fine. We're still good. That's why we have the get-out-of-jail-free card for situations just like that. Did scare me for just a second there. <laughs> stuff. Will it end up covering everything? I don't know, Amicia. I still don't really understand the nature of the threat here. Is it supernatural? Is it some viral thing that affects the rats as well? Maybe someday we'll find out. Oh, look at this. Wait a second. It just trapped me in here. I thought I was supposed to get back behind the rats back there. Wait, I wasn't done back there. <laughs> I want to go back. This is bullshit. She specifically said I had to take those guys out because that was how I would get past the rats. And now it's locked me on this side. What a pile of fuck nuts. Oh, okay. Well, maybe we'll come back at some point. Move it, blacksmith. There's work waiting for you. We're really scraping the barrel if Vitaly stoops to catching a beggar like this. A prisoner. Oh, well. Perhaps they'll finally open this door. I can't get past. Uh. Too many guards. Yeah, I'm definitely not going to be able to take all these guys out with my sling. Before they come and shove a sword up my ass. I guess I have to Somnum this guy? 
Oh, he's moving. Okay, good. How on earth did the rats do that? Imagine the force you need to get through that thickness. I can imagine what it will do to your arm. The hole's no use anymore. They've blocked it up, can't you see? They know exactly what they're doing, little bastards. Uh-huh. I'm not sure what I can get away with here. This won't open, right? Yeah. Okay, now if I make them look at the other direction, I should be good here. Let's go see. Be careful. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Yoink. Nothing to see here. All right. Whew. I don't like that they're just hanging out in that other room, though. I don't like that they could walk over here at any time. Well... Okay, so I'm trying to get over there. Huge swarm of rats just sitting right where I need to be. I can't get past. I have to get the rats out of the room. So if I swivel this way and then bring it back, does that clear them out from that side? No. Yeah, but I have to get them all over there first. Maybe I just use an odorous? Oh, but I have to give the rats a path to them. That's probably it. Let's just bring this over this way. And then I'll bet you they'll go swarm him. work. I haven't seen any roses for a while. Hope I haven't taken a wrong turn. Yeah, I pretty much have no idea where I am. Okay, I know I can make some room for alcohol. Hold up. Uh... There we go. I am doing a really good job of keeping myself topped out, guys. I really thought that the game would be more restrictive than it is in that regard, but I guess they just... They didn't want it to be that kind of game. They don't want you to have to, like, manage your resources all that much. They just want you to have what you need to get where you're going. And I respect that. Picked up some tools. Let's see if that gives me the option to make anything. Oh, yeah, here we go. Instruments. Ignifer ammo distracts nearby enemies. Better tools allow Musi to be more accurate in crafting Ignifer. The refined mixture gains increased power, causing it to crackle a lot as it burns. We can either do that, or we can do containers. This lets Amicia use her sling to throw a Luminosa. Thanks to a thicker container adapted to her sling, Amicia can now fire Luminosa without any risk of breaking it. Oh, I didn't even realize that I couldn't do that before. But, um, I think I'll go with this instead, especially given the area that we're in right now. This is probably going to be more useful to us. Huh. This should make things a little easier. Let's see. And then the next one here improves the speed of ammo crafting. We see it adapts her instruments to make using them outside easier. This shortens the time it takes to prepare ammo. That one doesn't really excite me all that much, because that's never been a problem. I guess I could see how it could become a problem at some point. But it never has been, so, like, whatever. I see a door back here. And we can't interact. Okay.
Are they drawing blood from this dude? Nicholas continues his search. In which case, the only thing that can help us find the book is the son of a smith. You built that door with your father. Now, you'll open it for us. We were asked to build that door precisely to keep out scum like you. I am the Grand Inquisitor Vitalis Benevon. You have no idea how I have suffered. Shut up. Look what I endure for you. Quick. The empty stand was. Killed his dad. All right, we gotta save Roderick. Quickly, I mustn't lose them. Oh shit. Even when the Grand Inquisitor talks about saving thy neighbor, you just can't keep your mouth. Okay, I don't think I could have gone the other Roderick. way, so. Looks like we both have problems. Blood's getting weaker. How long can the Episanguis contain the bite? As long as his faith allows. Okay, I'm just gonna slip past this dude here and that dude back there. The way she spoke made it sound like maybe this is a time thing, so. Although they seem to be waiting for me in there. What was that? Oh, that was it. Balls. Was it? I'll go and look. Everything's fine. Oh. There is nothing there. No point continuing. That's right. Woo! That was too close for comfort. He'll open it. With the book and the Darun kid, Vitalis can complete the conjuration. Then we'll be saved from the plague. Ad Ignem. Ad Lucem. Oh, well said. Move it! Now listen to me. Me and my friends spent some time in the jails of the Bastion, making the heretics talk. You're pretending to be tough now. Yeah, you guys see what I'm saying? These guys are just douchebags. That's all they are. There's like no good in these guys. I wonder if that's part of the plague too. Does it corrupt the hearts of men somehow? stuff over here. Let's see if I can do this. No, I can't. Oh, damn, that was close. Okay, I might have to might have to take this guy out. Didn't want to have to do it. He didn't leave me much choice. So screw him. 
The good news is that now I can pop over here too, which would not have been possible before. Oh, and look. That's strange. Study of a skinned person. Since autopsies are formally prohibited by the church, the practice of studying the human body is still in its infancy. Frightened by the gravity of the situation, Pope Clement VI then issued a papal bull authorizing doctors to open up the bodies of the dead in order to better understand and fight the plague. Unfortunately, few clergymen followed him, and most anatomical charts therefore came from books from the Orient. Interesting. Sounds kind of grim when you say it out loud, but you know what? It's a very important thing they did there. You do have to study dead people sometimes if it helps the people who are still alive. That was a nice little diversion. I don't think this is actually timed now that I have gotten to this point. I think she just said that because that's what she would say, you know? That guy has a big freaking weapon. We got nothing over here. Okay. I should probably just take this guy out, right? That's probably for the best. Actually, does the Deverantis work on him? He's like... He's super armored. Oh, this won't even work on him. Because he's massive. Get to work. Oh, you ruined the floor. Oh, heavy armor. Oh, there has to be a way. That mosaic took us weeks. We don't give a shit about your mosaic. Open the bloody door, or you'll end up like your old man. And I would kill you, you know. Just as soon as I remember how to open her. Because that's more. Yup. I've been wanting to do this for two days. Ah. I don't know who you are, but thank you. Yeah, no problem, buddy. We need to leave. The other guards must have heard that. What's that door? A special order. My father's masterpiece. And do you know how to open it? Because that would be a real help. Hey, you there! Guard! It would help us a lot. Son of a bitch! Take a bit of time. Carry on. I'll keep them back. Oh god, oh god! <laughs> You're really fast! That sucked! Need another Somnum. Oh shit! Wrong thing! Damn it! <laughs> Not enough materials. Okay. Whiffed that one. Whiffed it real good. I'm dead. I just wasn't ready, guys. I wasn't ready for, uh... To be bum-rushed like that. Heavy armor. Oh, there has to be a way. Okay. Not a problem. Not a problem. <laughs> I don't know who you are, but thank you. We need to leave. The other guards must have heard that. What's that door? A special order. My father's masterpiece. And do you know how to open it? Because that would be a real help. Hey, you there! Guard! It would help us a lot. It'll take a bit of time. Carry on. I'll keep them back. Okay, this time I'm ready. They're coming right down the pike. I don't want to rush you, but they're still coming, and it looks like a fire has broken out. Almost there. Come on, come on. That's it. Hurry up. Got the it. Alarm's been sounded. They won't let us go. Move it, kid. Move it. Okay, so we're in some kind of dungeon area. We need to hide. No, we need to slow them down. There have to be rats down here. Somewhere. Will will that do it? It'll have to. Right. We're in the basement. It's a start. Open up right away. Roderick, I need the book. What on earth is so special about this bloody book? could save my little brother, please. I don't know where it is. The only thing I know is that they tortured my father to death for it. And I'm gonna kill them. They killed my parents too. We might get out of here together. 
All right. What about the book? Just you wait and see. There's lots of them around here. Lots of what? Books? Because I'm going to need a specific one there, buddy. <laughs> okay, I have no choice but to leave this stuff behind. We have here. Oh, wow. Another library. Underneath the library. Forbidden books. That's why we bit the door. So the Sanguisitanera has to be here. All I know is it has a red cover. Look. Up there. Roses. That must be it. I'll have to climb up. Okie dokie. I guess we're getting close, guys. Start taking your bets on whether it's actually going to be there or not. Too high. I need something to get me up. Yeah, I was going to say, here's a spot we can climb up. Here's more stuff back here. More tools! Yay! Ugh, let's leave that where it is. Very yak. A decoction made up of more than 50 plant, mineral, and animal ingredients that take more than a year of fermentation for the properties to become complete. Against the great evil, it seems to have the effect of accelerating the development of bubos, thus making it possible to remove the infection after incision. Yeah. We'll just leave that where it is. I agree with Amicia. Let's see, let's see, guys. I'm actually really grateful that we're not being timed right now. Because I just like having time to wall crawl. It's just how I get down. That's where we came from. Hey, I see stuff back here. Give me that. Finding a fair amount of cord. Luckily. I wonder if that means I can make something new. Ooh, ammo bag. Or pouch. Uh, reduces time between shots. Yeah, that's going to help a lot. Or we can hold up to 20 ammo of each type. That would actually also be good because that would let me pick up a lot more stuff. That's actually a really difficult decision right now. Oh, man, I'm not sure, guys. Now, I've generally been okay with the combat. I mean, I died once in this chapter, but that... That was just because I wasn't ready. I didn't play it right. As long as I am aware of what's going on, it's usually been okay. So let's make the ammo bag. <sighs> Not bad. Not bad at all. And now I should be able to carry a lot more stuff. Well, a lot more odorous. It did not increase... Oh, wait, I guess it did increase my capacity for this stuff, but I don't have enough materials to make it. That's why I can't make it. I got you. Okay. That's good. Just can't remember if I actually had to leave something back here or not. Let me double check. No, we got everything. All right. Let's work on a puzzle. Roderick, I think I'm going to need your help with this. Could you help me with this? All right, all right. Interesting. The shelves form a path. That's your route to the book. Easy. Okay, so we have to lift this Could thing up. Hand? I'll do that. <sighs> okay, now can you hold it? Uh, maybe I spoke too soon. I need to act as a counterbalance. I'll stay over here. Tell me which lever you want me to pull. All right. Now. Yeah. You need to move, Amicia. No, you need to fucking pull it up. Come on. Go on. Fine for me. <sighs> Thank you. You said you'd act as a counterbalance. I did. It gave way. Right. We'll have to be very careful. Well, that is the plan. Okay, so... I'll start over here.
Luckily, this thing just kind of slid right into place. I didn't have to jimmy it all that much. Perfect. By the way, my name's Amicia, and you're Roderick, right? You know a lot of stuff, Amicia. Who hired you to do the door? Monks of a sort. They didn't talk much. My father designed it. He was the master. I was just the apprentice. Monks of a sort, watching over the Sanguinis Itinera. Okay, why don't you hit that one up? Now! All right. Oh shit, there's stuff down there, I just saw. Sorry, Roderick, give me a second. <laughs> I actually do need a lot of stuff now. Yes, I would not have wanted to leave that stuff behind, for sure. Did I see another glowy over here? Oh, it was just the handle. Gotcha, gotcha. Hey, buddy, just keep on holding that for me, please. It's too quiet. Where did the soldiers go? They're on their way. Don't rush it, Amicia. All right, now don't fuck this up, Roderick. Thank you. All right, now. Stop. Yeah. Roderick. Fine for me. Oh wait. Oh, it dropped that one when he let it go. I got you. Okay, let's see if this kills me. Move, Amicia. You're in the way. He won't do it. No, stop. Right away. Really? But if I can't move while he's holding it... Hmm... Go on! Alright. Can't you, like, hold it halfway down? Get off it then. Move, Amicia. You're in the way. You're in the way. That's it. Stop. Yeah. Okay, it's got to be another one that does something to these shelves. No. We need something underneath to stop it falling down. I'll find something. Oh, is that it? You want me to do that? Can't you go do that, dude? I guess it's on me. Okay. That just kind of makes this puzzle a pain in the ass. It's like unnecessary legwork. Uh, come on, move! Hey, don't injure yourself. Uh, you want me to? No, my brother. I owe him this for all the times I wasn't there for him. Yeah? Well, you'll have a hard time bringing the book back with a broken arm. That is stupid. We should have done this together, or you could have just done it yourself while I was already up there. But whatever. All right, lift it up. Now. Right away. That ought to well, do the trick. Love, I don't know what is. <laughs> right, let's get this over with. Hold on. Beautiful. Okay. Then we'll just go back and redo this. Go on. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Go ahead and drop it. No, stop. Right away. And I think we're good now. <laughs> That's it. Nearly there. Let's go. We've been here too long. I concur. Got it. 
can barely believe it. You'd better believe it and get back quickly. They'll be here any second. Uh-oh. Where are we going from here, though? I know you. Amicia Darun. We have been watching your family for quite some time now. Waiting for the macula in your brother's blood to finish its slumber. You could say, I have watched you grow up. No, we have no chance. Little idiot. What do you expect to do with that book? Save my brother. With your brother and that book, I can save the That's world. Enough. Come on, this way. God. Well, he destroyed my life. I know what that's like. So, do we trust him when he says that he can save the world with Hugo's blood and the book? I don't know, guys. He's definitely a creepy old asshole, but that doesn't mean he can't be right. What if we have to make a sacrifice at the end of this game, guys? Sacrifice Hugo for the good of the world. See, like, this hallway here. I still understand why this hallway exists. A lot of games don't do this. They wouldn't just build this hallway here and not have anything in it. It's so weird. Ready? It's gonna be hell out there. Ready as I'll ever be. Well, I've got eight rocks, so... Yeah, let's do this. Let's get out of these corridors, quick. Couldn't agree more. Let's go and find the others. Where the hell are they? We've certainly stirred them up. Quiet. I can't risk losing this book. All right. We'll just slowly creep up. Watch our frame rate die a little bit. How did it get so bad so quick? Heavy armor. We're stuck. He's looking the other way. I can take him. You sure? It'll be my pleasure. Whenever you're ready. I mean, okay, when the icon is displayed, press up to ask Roderick to silently take out an enemy. Wow. Dude, if he can actually do this, that's really handy. All right, go for it, dude. Roderick, you're up. That's for my father. Wow. Uh, dude. Do you do that a lot? No. But I'm starting to like it. <laughs> Roderick, you are my new best friend, buddy. Please don't ever leave me. In fact, please marry me, and let's have lots of children. Because I just fell in love with you. Right, that's enough. I'm off. You stay here. I'll go and see how they're doing. So let me know what the hell's going on. He's alone. But he will see me coming. I could distract him. Okay. Well, to work together. Eh? Oh, Jesus! Well. Right. <laughs> this dude is hyper aware of things that are going on. How do we distract him? Huh? How the fuck do I even approach this? Look at this. Yeah. Come on. Okay, here we go, here we go. Uh. What's all that noise? Oh, come on. Take care of him. You're going to pay. Well done. He won't be getting up anytime soon, trust me. Roderick. Oh. Oh, I'm so... I'm so... Satisfied right now, guys. I'm so vindicated. Being able to so easily dispatch these guys, even though it's not me doing it, quote unquote. It's just extremely gratifying. What have we in here?
Pull up on sulfur, okay. Uh, yes, make more ignifers. Excellent distraction items they are. In fact, let's just kind of max out on everything here. Lucas, he has trouble with his eyes sometimes. These might help. Reading stone. I still don't understand the difference between a curiosity and a gift. After centuries of ignorance, theories about how human vision works now abound. We started by believing that our eyes send out rays revealing objects around us before finally understanding that, in fact, the opposite is the case. People began to find remedies for vision problems. A good example is the creation of rough eyeglasses that improve their wearer's sight of objects nearby. Yes, this was, uh... This was a little too early for reading glasses, wasn't it? Maybe not. I don't know when they were invented. I know that Ben Franklin invented the bifocals, which were like a specific type of reading glasses, but I guess they already existed before he did that. Oh boy, we got two of them here. I don't like hanging around doing two. nothing like this. One each. All right. I'll take the one with the head. The cart. You're finished. Perfect. Oh, good job. I wouldn't like to have been on the end of that. Oh my god. I love it so much. Thank you for the rocks. I'm actually running kind of low on rocks. I gotta be careful here. If I get into another situation where they're just bum rushing me, it could turn out really bad. Keep the stuff coming. Oh, tell me it leads outside. It leads outside. <laughs> Fresh air. I can smell fire. Oh shit! Don't tell me, rats. Oh no. Fire! Shit. Did we? Fire is spreading! Is the Grand Inquisitor still inside? How do I know? Go and see! And give the order to evacuate! This is good. We should make the most of it. Ah, fucking rats. That's all I need. Oh! Rats, the shield. Oh, we can't touch it, Roderick. Wait. When they took me to the Bastion to question me, I saw the alchemists making some stuff they called the extinguish. It puts flames out. I was going to save it for later, but... Oh, okay. It's worth a try. You can now craft Extinguis. Yet another item, guys. Look at this. I'm so pimped. Okay, so this actually puts out fires. Which we can clearly use to our advantage. To aim at the fire. To, uh, have the rats devour this guy for us. Okay. That is pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome. Just gonna skirt around y'all here. A little of this, a little of that. We have so many options now, guys. All the books are going to burn. It's not your fault. Think about your book. Those kids started the fire so they can sleep away quietly. I'm gonna be sorry when I catch them. Wait, I just had the option to have him do a stealth takeout. Would that have really worked? From all the way over here? I can't get it back now. Maybe that was a fluke. I don't know. I guess I could just put out his fire. Amicia, his torch. Yeah. I just wanted to have you go do it. I wanted to see like how that would work. Oh well. No matter. Uh, so brutal. 
I love it. I love it, guys. And the best part about it is that it keeps the rats distracted, too. Well, head straight for the fire. It's the only way. Hold up, there's stuff there. Give it. Give it. Yeah! <laughs> Still full on sulfur. Are you kidding me? Hey, what's back there? Hold up, we got stuff back there. Let me, uh... Okay, this doesn't take sulfur. So, I think I actually have to leave this behind. Alright. I'm just gonna take the long way around here. Whoa. Um. I guess I could use Luminosa. That would open up a sulfur slot. <laughs> yeah. Probably the best course of action there, honestly. Let's go ahead and craft that. Don't need the bench. Yep, that was that was worth it. We got a lot of stuff for that. Beautiful. Wish I could hop those bushes right there. Okay, moving on then. What? What the fuck? You're on fire! You're on fire! Huh? No! No! Hey, you, you all right? Is there anyone still inside? Oh. Yeah, I thought I'd had it. It's like hell in there. Supposed to have reinforcements. What the hell are they doing? Two guards. We need to get one of them out of the way. Okay. I don't have a ton of cover here, which makes me really nervous. Ugh. I'm running like ever so slightly low on rocks, I feel like. Okay, this is risky, but let's try this, guys. That noise. I think it came from over there. Amicia, the helmets. I had a better plan. <laughs> okay. Now, you do your thing on this guy, right here. to somehow get the option. Okay. Let's take him over that way. Give Roderick a clear shot at him. Noise. What was it? That one's for you. You don't need to tell me twice. <laughs> Nailed it. Nice. I might have got a little carried away. Oh, you get carried away, Roderick. You get carried away, sir. Never have to apologize to me. Dang, there's just stuff strewn all over this area, guys. It's everywhere. Okay. I think that'll do it. Into the fire? Is that where we're going? Do we really have to go in there? Yes. Take a deep breath. Let's go. Okay. Uh, it's already hot. What a bloody mess. Oh, what? what are we going to do? 
going to do? Follow me, and look after your book. They're here. Don't worry about them. Okay, if you say so. Trusting you, Roderick. Come on, come on. Oh my god, let me jump! Fucking action hero, guys! Come on, follow me. <laughs> Sorry about your castle, but also fuck you guys. 